According to the 2008 Global Hunger Index, Punjab has the lowest level of hunger in India. Less than one-fourth of children below the age of five are underweight, although Punjab came off worse than countries like Gabon and Vietnam when measured on the index. Punjab has relatively good infrastructure. This includes road, rail, air and river transport links that are extensive throughout the region. Punjab has also one of the lowest poverty rate in India at 6.16% figures, and has won the Best State Performance Award, based on statistical data compiled by the Indian government. In 2012, the state was one of the highest receiver of overall remittances to India which stood at $66.13 billion .00 Indian rupees, below Kerala and Tamil Nadu. Macroeconomic trend this is a chart of trend of gross state domestic product of Punjab at market prices estimated by Ministry of Statistics and Program Implementation with figures in millions of Indian rupees. The traditional long-term financial policy of the Union government is to reward well-performing states. The state's debt was estimated at 62% of its GDP in 2005. Topic: Major industrial cities. Topic. Dara Basi, Jalandhar, Amritsar, Ludhiana, Patiala, Batinda, Batala, Kana, Faridkot, Rajpura, Mahali, Mandi Gabangar, Ropar, Firaspur, Sangruar, Malarkotla and Moga are major financial and industrialized cities. A big share of state's GDP comes from these cities. Topic. Agriculture Topic. Punjab the Five Rivers region is one of the most fertile regions on earth. The region is ideal for growing wheat crop. Rice, sugar cane, fruits and vegetables are also grown. Indian Punjab is called the Granary of India or India's Bread Basket. Many records mistakenly mention that it produces 43% of India's wheat, but that is actually its contribution to the national pool. It produces 17% of India. S wheat and 11% of India's rice 2013 data The total area of Punjab is just 1.4% of total area of India but it produces roughly 12% of the cereals produced in the country The largest grown crop is wheat Other important crops are rice cotton sugarcane pearl millet maize barley and fruits The principal crops of Punjab are barley wheat rice maize and sugarcane Among the fodder crops are bajra and jowar in the category of fruits, it produces abundant stock of kino. The main sources of irrigation are canals and tube wells. The rabi or the spring harvest consists of wheat, gram, barley, potatoes and winter vegetables. The curry for the autumn harvest consists of rice, maize, sugarcane, cotton and pulses. Agriculture sector is the largest contributor to the gross state domestic product GSDP of Punjab. According to 2013-14 data, the contribution of agriculture and allied industries in GSDP at factor cost is 28.13%. Industry The state has essentially an agrarian economy with a lower industrial output as compared to other states of India. A prominent feature of the industrial scenario of the Punjab is its small-sized industrial units. There are nearly 194,000 small-scale industrial units in the state in addition to 586 large and medium units. Dara Basi, Ludhiana is an important center for industry. In the 1980s there was a chance of a Hero Honda and Maruti Suzuki plant to be set up in Ludhiana but due to some circumstances of terrorism it was cancelled. Topic. Important industries Topic. The industrial units in the state are broadly divided into three Agro-based industrial units Machinery units Chemical units Topic. Textile industry 
The state produces nearly 25% of the best quality cotton in India. In spite of several advantages, there is one major disadvantage that the total spindlage capacity of the state is only 1.5% of the country. Dara Basi, Ludhiana is known as Manchester of India. Batala was once called as Iron Bird of Asia, as it produced the highest amount of CI casting, agricultural, and mechanical machinery. Batala is still one of the leading cities in northern India in manufacturing of CI casting and mechanical machinery. It's also an agricultural marketplace and industrial centre. Cotton ginning, weaving, sugar refining, rice milling are some of other business taking place here. The cotton mills are located at Abohar, Malote, Faguara, Amritsar, Karar, Mahali and Ludhiana. Malerkotla, Abohar, Malote and Batinda are important for cotton ginning and pressing and nearly 25.3 million, 25 million bales of cotton are pressed annually over here. About 97 million kilograms of yarn and 36.5 million meters of cloth were produced in the cotton textile mills of Punjab. But only 43% of the cotton yarns formed in Punjab is used within the states and the remaining is sold outside the state. Pesticides introduced in the Green Revolution played an important part in the bustling cotton industry. The most common biopesticides in Punjab are Bacillus thuringiensis Bt. With the introduction of Bt cotton, the total Punjab cotton area increased from 449,000 hectares in 2002 to 560,000 hectares in 2005. During this time frame, production of cotton has also increased, from 1.08 million bales 170 kilograms each to 2.2 million bales, making up about 11-12% of the country's total production of cotton. Overall textile production of Punjab is predictable at 105,000 million rupees, as well as 32,500 million rupees sell abroad of knitwear, shawls, made-ups, bed sheets, pillow cases, duvet covers, and curtains, and yarns. The direct and indirect employ of textile doings in the state of Punjab is predictable at 2 million people," said Mr. H. S. Chima, Chairman, Punjab Committee, Northern India Textile Mills Association Sugar industry the sugar mills in Punjab are located at Batala, Gurdaspur, Bogpur, Faguara, Nawanshur, Zira, Marinda, Rakra, Duri, Fazilka, Nakodar, Dasua, Budhewal, Bulada, Makarian, Tarn Taran, Ajnala, Faridkot, Jagrayan, Amlo, Patran, and Lauka. Butter Sivian near Baba Bikala. One of the salient features of the sugar industry is that out of the 22 mills, 15 are in the cooperative sector and 7 are privately owned. Compared to the state of Uttar Pradesh and some other Indian states, the size of the sugar mills in Punjab is small. The cooperative sugar mill at Marinda is the biggest in the state with a daily crushing capacity of 4,000 tons of sugarcane. Six of the cooperative sugar mills are inoperative while the remaining nine crush cane during the season which is about 150 days. <laughs> Dairy industry. The primary source of milk and other dairy products in the state is the buffalo. The state ranks at the top in the country in the availability of milk after Haryana and Gujarat. The milk plants are mainly located at Virka Amristar district, Ludhiana, Mahali, Jalandhar, Patiala, Hoshiarpur, Gurdaspur, Ferozapur, Sangruar, Batinda, Faridkot, Naba, Moga, Kot Kapura and Hamira. The plant at Moga is the biggest plant in the state with a processing capacity of nearly 435,000 litres of milk. The first Amul milk plant of Punjab state was opened in 2015 at Batala. Topic power topic Total energy of the state is provided by the PSPCL owned thermal plants at 1260 megawatts Guru Gobind Singh Super Thermal Plant at Ropar, B 440 megawatts Guru Nanak Dev Thermal Plant at Batinda, C 920 megawatts Guru Hargobind Thermal Plant at Lara Mahabat and its own hydro power plants I 110 megawatts Shannon Power House at Jogandar Nagar, E 600 megawatts Ranjit Sagar Dam at Shah Pure Kandy, E 
91.35 MW UBDC Power Houses, IV 207 MW Macarian Heidel Project, V 134 MW Anand Pure Sahib Heidel Channel, V Mini and Micro Hydro Power Plants on Sirhind Canal and its distributaries, in Adidian to that it gets its share from YHDRO Power Plants under the control of BBMB, A 1325 MW Bakra Dam Left and Right Bank Power Houses B 155 MW Hydro Power Plants on Bakra Main Line at Gangawal and Kotla, C 396 MW Hydro Power Plant at Pong, D 990 MW Power Plant at Dahar. A new thermal plant is set up in Rajpura, Punjab with 1400 MW of power capacity inaugurated on 8 December 2013. Another thermal plant in Batinda with capacity of 1980 MW power will come up soon. The common pool projects are the Bakra Nangal complex, the Dahar power plant and the Pong power plant. Punjab shares about 51% of the power generated from the Bakra Nangal complex, 48% from the power generated at the Pong project. Topic common pool projects topic Bakra Nangal Complex The Upper Bari Dobe Canal System UBDC, The Shana Power House topic Thermal Electricity topic Guru Nanak Dev Thermal Plant, Batinda was completed in 1974. The Guru Nanak Thermal Plant has four units of 110x4 MW capacity. Ropar Thermal Power Plant consists of six units capable of generating 210 MW each. The plant is spread over an area of about 2,500 acres 10 square kilometers on the banks of River Sutlej. A 1,980 MW thermal plant is under execution at Talwandi Sabo in Batinda district by Stairlight Industries. A 540 MW thermal plant is under implementation at Goindwal Sahib in district Amritsar by GVK Power. A 2,640 MW thermal plant at Gitterbaha District Batinda and a 2,100 MW thermal plant at Rajpura are in the pipeline. A number of biomass and agro-waste based power plants are under construction by private companies in collaboration with PEDA based on renewable energy. Topic business and infrastructure Topic Punjab has good infrastructure. Its road, rail, air and transport system is rated one of the best in the country with ranking of 210 points compared to the national average of 100 in NCAER's Infrastructure Index. It has highest per capita generation of electricity in India, which is 2.5 times the national average. All major cities in Punjab benefit from this and have some of the highest tariffs in India. All of Punjab's villages have been electrified and connected to the state electrical power grid since 1974. Total road network 47,605 km all cities connected by national highways. All major towns of adjoining states connected by national highways. Percentage of villages connected by metalled roads 97% national highways, 1,000 km state highways, 2,166 km major district roads, 1,799 km other district roads, 3,340 km link roads, 31,657 km source, NCAER and Punjab government in add it the state has nearly asterisk 100% electrification and nearly 100% potable water facilities facility to the population of the state. Topic Databank Topic Economic and Statistical Organization Punjab ESO, is the nodal statistical agency of state government of Punjab. It acts as data bank and provides statistics to various stakeholders on various socio-economic issues of the state. Topic see also topic http colon slash slash asaf.gov.in slash default ASPX References Topic <references>